Okay, guys, let's talk about karyotypes. A karyotype is a picture of chromosomes from an individual. So if you wanted to get a, a karyotype done for yourself, you would give one of your cells. The individual doing the karyotype would wait for your cells to start mitosis. Your chromosomes would show themselves. Then a picture would be taken, taken, and then chromosomes would be matched up based on size, uh, banding pattern, or gene location. And they would be paired up in homologous pairs. Okay, so these are homologous chromosomes. All right, if you have two copies of each chromosome, you're good. You get one copy from your mom and one copy from your dad. One copy from your mom, one copy from your dad. One copy from your mom, one copy from your dad, and so forth. So what can we tell about this pedigree? Well, everything looks normal. Is it a boy or a girl? Let's look. The way you can tell the gender is by looking at the sex chromosomes. The sex chromosomes okay, are the 23rd pair and they determine gender. In this situation, it's going to be a male because of the Y chromosome. Best way to remember this is Y makes a guy. Y makes a guy. If there's a Y chromosome present, it's going to be a male. Now let's look here. What do we have? We are looking at a human female. How do you know? You know by looking again at the sex chromosomes. Okay, so here we have two X's. And remember that two X's equals female. Does this person have two sets of chromosomes? Yeah. So everything's okay. 23 pairs of chromosomes means human. Remember that diploid number of number of chromosomes in a diploid human cell is 46. Number of chromosomes in a haploid half of 46 would be 23. 23 pairs make a diploid. So now, continuing on the path of karyotypes, let's look at, if we look at this karyotype right here, homologous pair, homologous pair, homologous pair, one copy from the mom, one copy from the dad, one copy from the mom, one copy from the dad, and so forth, homologous pair, homologous pair, but wait. What do you see here? Three copies of chromosome 21. Trisomy 21 is Down syndrome. Okay, it's a genetic disorder. So, is this a female or a male? Look at the sex chromosomes. You can see it's a female. So here we have, by looking at this karyotype, we can tell that this person is a female with Down syndrome. So the way you use karyotypes is you look at the chromosomes. If you find any abnormalities like trisomy, you can have trisomy 21, you can have trisomy 13, and you can also tell the gender of the individual based on looking at their sex chromosomes.